She's been over my house for two days and she hasn't left. <laughs> She's a fabulous um, Bronx entertainer. Other than Mara. I feel bad. For those of you that work with me, I feel bad because she came in the, in the snowstorm. But anyway, um, Sasha, just come on stage so people can see you. Come over here, Sasha. She, no, no, I need to give her the respect. Okay? She volunteered to get, you know, to not do it, to show the video because she doesn't, you know, it's a, it's a serious story, it's a serious thing. Sasha, just tell us what you do. Just tell us. Yeah. Hi, I'm a modern dance. I'm a modern dance choreographer, and the reason Apollonia asked me here is because I'm doing an evening-length modern uh, song and music dance piece at the Alvin Ailey Theater on June 8th, which is about gay life in New York from 1965 to 1965. And I, I really learned a lot um, researching about what it was like to be hidden, forbidden, how much you could be arrested for just being gay, you know, all of that. I deal with the Sippin, Julius Sippin, Madison Society, and Stonewall and the AIDS era. And the name of it is called Come Back Once More So I Can Say Goodbye. And at the end, the living and the dead are um, reunited with the people that they loved. And then they go off. Josie, <laughs> respect. It's a serious <laughs> Serious choreographed evening, June 8th, and it's a benefit for Broadway Cares Equity Fight AIDS and the Anti Violence Program. Alvin Ailey, June 8th. Okay. Thank you. That's it. Sasha, give them your website. We have one. Okay. Um, www.labyrinthdancetheater.org. All right. And if any of you have been at Stonewall, I'd be happy to talk to you if you know anything about the history, because I'm learning and researching about it as well. And two reasons I did it, because the younger generations don't know about how hard it was to win these freedoms that everybody takes for granted, and how easy it is now to um, not die from AIDS, because it was a horrible time in the 80s, everybody was dying. Now it's really very easy, so I think people don't appreciate so much, you know, younger generations, really. And also, for older people who were in the village at the time, it's kind of a nostalgia and looking back and a, a cathartic simpatico to say goodbye to remember your friends who died of AIDS. So. Sasha, once again, thank you for being here. And my apologies, okay? I love you. And we'll talk very soon, okay? We'll talk very soon, all right? Thank you so much. Here's your the DVDs. Thank you. Let's give it up one more time for Sasha Spielrogo. She actually opted to not show her CD because she doesn't want to, some of you, especially you, gotta get bored. 